Hello everyone, and welcome to my Sister Wise 4E channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Savannah Brown, Janelle Brown's youngest child with Cody Brown, is attempting to make sense of Garrison Brown's suicide. This is the first time his younger sister has spoken up in the two weeks after he committed suicide. What is the 19-year-old saying now that he has sadly passed away? Continue reading for further information. Savannah Brown attempts to interpret the suicide of Garrison. Savannah Brown was one of the three kids living at home with Janelle Brown during the pandemic. Their father, Kobe Brown, did not like that her brothers, Gabrielle and Garrison Brown, were also present. He believed it was simply too risky for them to live their lives outside the house, while Gabrielle was a college student and had a girlfriend, Garrison was employed. Savannah, a high school student, was required to do all tasks from a distance. She made an effort to persuade her brothers to follow suit in the hopes that Cody would visit more frequently, but nothing she did would suffice. Fans have criticized the Sister Wise staff the fact that Garrison and Cody were still at odds when he passed away. They think he could have spent more time with his kids and shown them more support. It got to the point where some program viewers spoke up and said that Cody was probably going through enough. Hatred had to end as a result. With the exception of his father's wife, Robin Brown, Garrison's parents, and several of his siblings have all made public statements. However, the term suicide has not been utilized in practice, notwithstanding Maddie Brown Brush's discussions regarding mental health and suicide. Savannah Brown recently uploaded pictures of herself and her older brother on Instagram. In addition, she honored him even as she found it difficult to comprehend his suicide. On Tuesday, March 5, two weeks ago, my older brother Garrison took his own life. He was 25. It's difficult for me to understand. More than anything else, though, I now know that my brother Garrison is no longer in suffering— I'm always reminded that dad is no longer with us when I see a car that looks like his on the road and wonder for a moment if it's him driving home from work. I think of him when I prepare PB and Jace. He's there when I glance up at the night sky. I sincerely hope that whoever is reading this knows how much of a void their loss would leave. Continue to be persistent for the benefit of your loved ones, your family, and your friends. 1-800-273-10-K- 8255 is the National Suicide Prevention Lifeline number. Tragic. Savannah Brown's family immediately responded with kind remarks. Janelle Brown, her mother, told her she adored North Carolina, where she had found comfort. After Garrison Brown's funeral, she traveled there to reside with Maddie Brown Brush and her three kids. Individuals have kept in touch with the family, sharing personal accounts of how suicide has impacted their lives. Every time the children look up at the sky, they can't help but think about Garrison. He was well known for loving the stars, even using a telescope to show them off to his niece and nephew. This dedication is heartbreakingly wonderful. How do you feel about what Savannah said to her brother? Please share your opinions in the comments section below. Robert Garrison Brown, the star of Sister Wives, received recognition at his funeral on March 9, according to his cousin Emma. Four days after the 25-year-old was discovered dead from a self-inflicted gunshot wound, she talked about how tough it was to say goodbye to her cherished family member. She composed a long statement saying, I had to get ready for your funeral today, and this is everything I wish you could have heard before I had to say goodbye. You are loved. I don't even have a photo of you that doesn't have your infectious smile. I'm not sure if I can express how much I'll miss you. She went on, I wish I could hug you and tell you how much I cherish you. Even though you were only human and had imperfections, our friendship never wavered in my mind. Emma shared a few of her favorite experiences with Garrison with her followers as she wrapped up her speech. I will always be grateful for the moments I had with you. We only managed to go on one of the several backpacking trips that we had planned. I'll miss our dinners together our silly dad jokes, and our coffee runs, she said as she concluded the heartfelt message. When we used to watch movies together, you used to always let me to cover our faces with unkempt face masks. 
You always made sure I understood I could talk to you at any time and that I had eaten. You were a soldier, a friend, a brother, and a son. I pray that, if a deity exists, he is granting you serenity. Robert, I adore you. Although the specifics of the funeral are still unknown, it is certain that Janelle Brown, Garrison's mother, received assistance from her five children. Logan, 29, Madison, 28, Hunter, 27, Gabriel, 22, and Savannah, 19, who she shared with Cody Brown. In the days following his passing, Garrison's siblings and extended relatives have openly honored him on social media. Whether or not Cody, 55, was present remained a mystery. Garrison and his father had a falling out over his rigorous COVID-19 standards, which led to their estrangement from each other over a number of years. As to a police report acquired by In Touch on Wednesday, March 6, Janelle, 54, said Flagstaff police that at the time of his death, he and his father were not on speaking terms. The grief at the Felder family started when Gabe found Garrison dead inside his Flagstaff. At the time, a representative for the Flagstaff Police Department stated in a statement to In Touch that there was no sign of foul play. After learning about concerning texts that Garrison had sent in a group chat the day before his body was discovered, Janelle had sent Gabe to check on him at his house. When word leaked out about their son's passing, Cody and Janelle posted a devastating joint message on their individual Instagram pages. Janelle and I am very sorry to inform you of Robert Garrison Brown's passing. He was our beautiful boy. The former couple started off by saying, he was a bright spot in the lives of all who knew him. Our loss will leave a void in our life that is so immense, it will leave us speechless. The two continued, we kindly request that you respect our privacy and join us in celebrating his memory. Garrison shared a happy final Instagram post five days before he passed away. In a happy picture, he showed his fans how he welcomed a rescue cat into his furry family. Miss Buttons, the newest addition to my house. My savior complex couldn't suffice for my nine-year-old daughter who was on the verge of euthanasia, he tweeted, along with a hashtag, crazy cat lady. A second picture of Garrison's new cat getting to know his other two cats was attached. On October 8, 2023, Janelle disclosed that her sons were being impacted by Garrison and Gabe's conflicts with their father in a Sister Wise episode. In a confessional, Janelle said, I'm concerned about my boy's mental health. Everything affects Gabrielle emotionally and intensely. He is a child who stays silent, though. Garrison just seems angry or sadder, like he's not as happy-go-lucky as he used to be, the woman continued. In the same episode, Gabe stated, My dad and I are at odds because when we voiced our dissatisfaction with the way COVID was going, I was met with nothing but a wall and there was no line of dialogue. That, in my opinion, is what ultimately strained our relationship. In the same season, Garrison expressed how much he missed having Cody in his life. During a chat with his mother, brothers, and Cody's sole present wife, Christine and Robin Brown, Garrison said to Robin, you know what, own him. Now that we are all mature adults, we no longer require a father figure. A few of his siblings observed, nodding in concurrence. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.